Hey everyone, in this video, I wanted to show you how to use iMessage on a Mac. So on a MacBook Pro or iMac or really any Mac, you could use iMessage and send text messages through your computer rather than your phone. And it makes it a lot easier and faster. So let's go through the setup process. The very first step is on your Mac is you want to find iMessage. So you could click Launchpad and come to iMessage. Most likely it's on your dock, so you could look for this icon on your message. Or you could go to the search icon up here, look up for iMessage, and then it should be the top hit here. Go ahead and open it. And this is what it's gonna look like. It's gonna require you to sign into your Apple ID because it wants to sync between all your devices here with your iMessage. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And once you log into your Apple ID, this is what the iMessage window looks like. So to create a new message, you want to type in the recipient's name, phone number, email, whatever it may be. So I'm gonna just go ahead and pick someone here. And now that I've picked that person, I could just go down here to iMessage and then type in a message up over here. And next to it, I could press the emoji icon to send an emoji. So I could send this emoji here. So now with my text and emoji, I could just press send and then that will send it to the person that I just decided to message. And then it says deliver just like any message using your phone. So again, you could either type someone's name or to draft a new message, you could press this icon here, compose new message, and then you could choose a new person to send a message to. Let me just choose a new person here. I could go ahead and text that person. So that's how you send messages right here. And if you go over here to preferences, you could change some of these settings. You could keep messages forever or change it to 30 days or one year. You could change the size of the message and the messages will be received in my download folder in this case. And this person is texting me back. So I will get the text just the same way as I would on my phone. And the last thing I wanna show you is under accounts. You could go under accounts and you could make sure that this is enabled in iCloud as well. So it syncs between all your devices and that the message could be reached on your email or your phone as well. These are all the different settings and your blocked options are also over here. So all the phone numbers that you have blocked show up right here and you could always add to them from this window. So between those, that should get you started with iMessage on a Mac. Again, it's a much faster way to typing for me than using my phone. And I use it all the time, especially when I'm at work and I wanna text someone real quick. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a like and subscribe to this channel for a lot more tech videos just like this one. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks so much for watching.